Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a magic review. Hey, today we're gonna look at Chartistry from Daniel Chart. What is it? Uh, basically, it's 10 routines, 10 card tricks uh, that you can do just with a deck of cards. Uh, Daniel walks through everything you need to do to pull off these 10 modern miracles. And uh, if you wanna see it, this is it. This is Chartistry. I'm gonna give the um, deck a few cuts like so. And then this time, I'm actually trying to locate a special card here. The one we've actually cut to is the Ace of Hearts. So if you watch the Ace like so, all we need to do is snap, and that's when we get one, two, three, and four. So now we've found the aces, we're going to do almost like a warm-up exercise. So similar to a pianist playing the scales, we're going to take the aces, loosen them back in the deck, and then find them one at a time. Okay? okay? Yeah. So I'm going to um, take the aces like so, so you can still see them in this, like this. Mm -hmm. I'm going to place the aces, one near the bottom, one near the slightly above this, one near the middle of the deck, and one slightly near the top. So just so you don't think I'm controlling them in any particular manner, if you just want to square those in, yep. so you know everything at this point is completely fair, yeah? Excellent, so I'm not going to uh, manipulate the cards. So I now need to, um, to see where the aces are. Done. Yeah? And that sounds like a bizarre thing. It doesn't really look like I did anything. If I actually snap and click, that should be the first ace, the ace of spades. The second ace takes just a matter of time. Like this. The next one should appear like so. If we actually shake, that'll be ace number three. So the last one we need to find is the lady's best friend, diamonds, yeah? Yep. So you actually watch the ace. This one should appear mid-air. So that should be the spade, hearts, clubs, and the ace of diamonds. Oh. There we go. Thank you. All right, so that was Daniel Chard. You might remember he did Chard Shark. He did self-working to finger bleeding. Uh, this is published by RSVP Presents. All right, so what I liked about it, it's self-contained. It's a DVD that has 10 effects, and you don't need anything else but a deck of cards. There are some arts and crafts uh, to it, but it's really simple things that you can do with things that are around the house. Another thing I really liked about this is these are really solid routines. Uh, what I mean by that is you're getting kind of uh, a little story and a little presentation along with each one. These aren't just uh, 10 quickies that are just over and done with. You are getting two hours of instruction and uh, performance with this. And so these are really uh, big uh, routines. These are monster routines. And I think that Daniel's done a really great job in putting this together. All right, so a couple questions we always ask about all of our magic tricks. The first of which is, what's in the box? Uh, what's in the box? You get a DVD. It's a DVD, kids. That's all you're kidding. Uh, there's nothing extra. There's no download code. There's no uh, like gimmick inside to rig a deck. Uh, basically, you're getting 10 effects that all work straightforward with a deck of cards. Is it what I thought? Uh, yeah, it's what I thought. Uh, the ad copy said that it was 10 card tricks and you're getting 10 card tricks. What's the overall quality and production value of the DVD? Hey, it's everything you'd expect from RSVP Presents. It's all shot in HD, you're getting multiple camera angles, uh, the uh, spectators are, are lovely and you get a nice um, uh, performance area and review area. In the reveal shots, uh, Daniel's going over everything you need to know. He's spending a lengthy amount of time uh, going over every single effect. He's not just teaching them to you very quick and you have to rewind and go, what, what was that? Uh, and he's very calm, uh, very collected. He's a very patient teacher. And I think uh, you're getting a really solid teaching with this and some very cool, very creative routines. All right, so how much practice does it require? Uh, I will say, yeah, it does require some practice. And like I said earlier, these are routines. They're not just tricks. And so there is a lot of memory work involved with this happens and then this happens next and then this happens next. There's a lot to it. These aren't just like really quick uh, effects. And I think that is gonna kind of bump this DVD up into the intermediate and advanced skill level. I know uh, the ad copy says it's great for beginners. There aren't that many effects on here though, I, in my opinion, for a beginner or someone who doesn't know their way around a deck of cards. Uh, there's probably only two out of the 10 that I would say are really easy and don't require a lot of skill. I would say Chartistry is not just a uh, DVD for somebody who knows their way around the deck of cards. I would say that they probably also need to be pretty familiar with some slights and have performed uh, magic like this before. All right, so what are some positives? Uh, positives, like I've been saying, uh, it's just a solid, solid, solid DVD. Uh, I love the fact that you're getting these long presentations where uh, the magic happens in progression or uh, there's multiple magical reveals in each effect. You know, it's not just a one hit, like, oh, there's the magical surprise and now it's over. You're getting all these little, like, instant little pops uh, throughout the trick until the final reveal, which uh, kind of builds up the tension. It builds up the excitement, I think, for the spectator and makes these some really cool effects. 
All right, so some negatives. You know, like we say around here, there's negatives to everything. These are just my negatives. They don't have to be yours. Uh, I don't got any. I don't have any negatives. There's nothing wrong with this DVD. I love it. Uh, it was great. I think it's definitely uh, well recommendable. Hey, is it worth your money? It's 30 bucks. 30 bucks for uh, 10 tricks, that's $3 a trick. $3 a trick is nothing. Uh, most of us pay a lot more than that for a download. So uh, definitely want to head down and pick this up if you are into cards and card magic. Like I said, who would like this? People who know the way around a deck of cards, people that are in the intermediate to advanced skill level. I think people that uh, do magic professionally would like this. And I think that would be good in a person that needs routines, especially for like table hoppers or people that do walk around at restaurants. I think would dig uh, Chartistry a lot. All right, so that is Chartistry from Daniel Chard. And if you'd like to purchase your own, you can find it at one of your favorite Murphy's Magic Supplies. Thanks, bye.